Hi. Huh. So, once again, and I'm really sorry for this. This is unplanned. I just wanted to do a live here again. Hello, hello. Welcome. I just felt like coming here. So I found this uh, recycled little laundry paste, I guess. And I thought we could squeeze it. Let me get this out of here. And my old scrub mom. Thank you. I love them too. So is there a topic you guys want to talk about? Or are we just going to squeeze? How's life going for me? Well, what can I say? <laughs> I had to have a um, molar removed. And it was the most pain I have felt, I don't know if in my life, because I gave birth, but probably in a long time. It was horrible. And you know, going to the dentist, I don't know about you. I'm sorry, I don't have aerial powder. I don't have anything right now. So that's why I'm going live with this recycled mix. But I'm going shopping maybe later today. And I'll, pro I'll certainly get aerial. See, I love this nail color because it's the same color as when you mix, when you rinse Ariel. <laughs> That's the color I was going for. Thank you. That's my favorite product of Ariel, of course, and Pinol and Lavender Fabuloso. Actually, I love every product. <laughs> Is this my first life? No, it's like my third or fourth life. I'm still getting the hang of it. yesterday's rinse water so we're gonna do that how about a little waterfall huh okay just hold on so I have this little pitcher and that was beautiful wasn't it
have no idea, but I haven't been feeling the urge to squeeze anymore or actually to film, edit and post anymore. I feel like, um, you know, of course I don't do this for the views, I do it for me. That's why I've been filming, well not filming, I've been squeezing off camera or doing the dishes or something like that. But I feel like, you know, being judged probably, or maybe being in competition with myself because of the statistics. <gasps> Thank you, Taja. I love those roses. Well, what I was saying is feeling like you're in competition with yourself because the statistics show that your views have dropped or that uh, people didn't like this video that you put a lot of effort in or probably um, nobody saw what you uploaded. It really, really is hard on your mental health. Do I prefer sudsy pastes or powdery pastes? Oh my God, I have no idea. You know, I love suds. What I know is that I don't like Comet or Ajax or any of the bleach powders. I, I don't feel, you know, attracted to that. I love laundry pastes. So we're going to let this fade out and I'm going to uh, recycle it or put it back into the container and we're going to be using it again soon. And you know what? How about I come back and we rinse the sponges live? We just have to wait for the suds to fade out a little bit. What is best, pine sol or fabuloso? Oh, well, they're so different. In my country, they only sell uh, the pine version of pine sol. So, probably, oh, they're so different. It's, it's like they're not even the same. <laughs> I love them all. I love this. Okay guys, so we're gonna let this fade out and I'll be back in a couple of hours to rinse, to recycle and rinse. I love you. Thank you for joining me. <laughs> I know this was a little bit lame, but we'll be back and I'll answer your questions in my next Hi, so we're back. So this is how the paste or mix settled when we were, while we were gone. Okay, so I thought that this is just water.
are going to put the mix back into the bucket using my beautiful scrub mummy. Oh, thank you, Sponjas Espumas. I love you. with a glass or a little cup but I don't have anything right now so we'll do our best mm -hmm. you can see this okay thank you for the likes <laughs> I love this. That's what I love about going live. That I can see your little likes and your comments. Why didn't I use the sponge first? What sponge? I don't know. So this is the recycling part, not, I don't know if it's boring. To me, this is, a, this is very relaxing. So I enjoy it a lot. Okay. I just started, yes. You're just in time. We're just putting this away. Okay. And now. We're just gonna make some suds before the rinse and clean up. What's in this mix? Well, it was a recycled mix that um, had probably, I don't remember the exact video this was from, but it had Ariel and I can smell Pinol in here. And I mixed it with yesterday's um, rinse water. That's why it was very liquid when I put it back. And right now we are rinsing. Okay, so we're gonna add some tap water. And make it very watery. So, 
Oh, yes. <laughs> this gave me a little bit of allergies. my nose clears. Why am I draining it? Because this is a rinse. We are rinsing the sponges and cleaning. This is left over. This is not the mix. This is what was left over and it's mixed with water. I don't know if you were here for the recycling part, but I saved like most of it. And because this is a rinse, well, this is a live, I don't have time to let the suds fade. So. So I thought I could go back to basic ASMR by T, which is something I used to do a lot when I started, and I'll show you. And I don't know if she's still here, but I want to thank my friend Esponjas Espumas for introducing me to this product. Fabric soft. Mm, this smells good. This was one of my favorite things to do when I first started out. What's my favorite scent of fairy fish soap? I've never tried fairy. They don't sell that in where I live. I live in Guatemala, which is a third world country. Um, my reality is very different from yours. Um, so I'm seeing a question. What are my pronouns? Um, I think I'm a she. I have to say that is something that is not common in my country. We are still very behind and I am learning through social media about all that and I, I love it. I love how people can be themselves, their selves this time of um, our history as a human race. We've been 
um, what's the word? Oppressed for so long. It's nice to see freedom. And I. What will you do when the rinse is finished? Then I'm finished. I don't know. <laughs> I'm sorry. I don't know if I understood your question. Remember, English is my second language. Okay, so the thing about using fabric softener is that I don't like my sponges being that soft. So we're going to make some suds and clean that fabric softener off. Using dish soap. This is the soap I use in my sink. It's Axion, um, the green one. And here we go. This is very hot water. It's very nice. Ooh, <laughs> look at my eye. So I did this because I want to clean up the fabric softener so my sponges don't get too soft and greasy. Eat it. No, I don't eat cleaning products, darling. Sorry. Now this Acción Limón was actually the first product that got me hooked on sponges and squeezing. This is what I used to do my dishes and I thought the smell of it de-stressed me but actually it was the squeezing, it was the zuds. Well, it's everything right now. So how many of you have pica? Pica, how do you call it? In Spanish, I think it's pica. Is it pica in English? What account got me into the sponge ASMR world? You know, I don't remember. I started out um, watching at uh, bar soap cutting videos. That was my first introduction to ASMR on Instagram. And then um, sponge accounts started popping up in my... Um, what's I don't know what you call that. Mm just started popping up and I followed every account <laughs> that popped up because I realized sponges were my thing. So I don't know which one was the first, but I do know my first uh, crush, <laughs> you could say, was ASMR for the love of I don't know if you guys remember her. She was like the queen of sponge ASMR a couple of years ago. And now she's not active anymore. But she was my first favorite account. And Sponjas Espumas, of course. Am I monetized on YouTube? Yes. I don't make a lot of money, but I am monetized. I... My mom made fun of me the other day because I don't actually make enough to pay for the product <laughs> yet.
and yes, all my family and friends know about this. Some of them follow me on on the different platforms I'm in, and they're very supportive. They probably think I'm weird, but they are very supportive. <laughs> you would be really happy if I do a video showing my sponge collection. Yeah, I would. I'll, I'll do it. Thing is... <laughs> Do you remember I moved like two months ago and all my sponges are still in bags and boxes. That's why I've been using the same sponges. Okay, so here we go. Oh, so hot. Hey, Bubble Squeeze. I'm doing great. How are you? Thank you for joining. So happy you're here. I'm so happy everyone's here. I really, really love TikTok. I like how supportive you guys are, how I haven't seen drama yet. And most of the comments are very, very sweet and nice, and that's what I am looking for. You know, this hobby or whatever you consider it should be our safe space. It should be a place where we go and just relax and be at peace. And that's what I'm looking for, peace. Everybody who's just joining us, thank you for being here. This is so satisfying, so watery and bubbly. Probably one of my favorite uh, consistencies. the sponge <laughs> You know, my new street is sort of where they send all the motorcycles that come to where I live. They have to go through my street. And that that is the window right here. 
here. <laughs> there. So I always have to cut them out because as you know, some motorcycles are very noisy. Well, I don't know if you guys enjoyed this. I know my lives are a little bit boring. I've seen very um, upbeat lives, but I'm always on the down side. Down side. But it is what it is. That song has been stuck in my head all day. How you doing? Da da da. When you're pregnant, you kind of crave this because your iron, I think, goes down. So this, I don't know why it helps, but when you have a low iron, you sometimes crave this. You, you crave the squeezing and the cleaning products and this, I don't know if it's the sounds or what it is, but it helps a lot of pregnant women. <laughs> start uh, watching these videos thank you for sharing my live okay so we're almost finished say hi Kenzie <laughs> hi Kenzie hi Kenzie hi Kenzie to do sponge squeezes before you go to bed and when you wake up just to get on with my day I used to be like that too when I started whenever I got stressed I got a sponge and squeezed <laughs> and you know to, to relax it becomes sort of because it's so soothing you when you start you look for it all the time because it's such a good feeling when you're doing it, um, even more than when you're watching it. You know, that little girl, <laughs> she's a screamer. Every afternoon she's out there screaming. <laughs> okay, so I wanna thank you for joining my very boring live but I had promised you guys we would rinse live and I keep my promises I will do another one very soon because I really enjoy but you know what keep those little hearts coming if you want lives just like the people from the circus who, who live off your applauses. I want to see your likes. <laughs> They're what keeps me going. So, 
thank you. I'll try to download it and post it here, even though I know it's boring. But I love you. Thank you so much for being part of my world.